Rivera in the white and black. Red ankle band. Schaefer in the black and the white. Green ankle band. Pay attention to the bands, is what I'm saying to you. Elbow pass. And Geronimo does a real good job of changing levels, changing sides. Um, I saw him yesterday. I think I posted on Instagram as well. Very versatile on top. Can score with a lot of different stuff. In fact, I believe in one of his early round matches, picked up a tech fall by using two completely separate, or excuse me, four completely separate turns. Two isn't that impressive. Four is pretty impressive, though. He went bar and a half. He went power half. He went cradle. And he also went tilt. Nice little scramble to a takedown here for Geronimo Rivera. And Isaiah Schaefer finds himself in a two-point two hole against somebody that's pretty darn good on top. Who goes in. I'm going to try to get it in. Schaefer makes his way to a quad pod. Nice little escape there for Isaiah Schaefer. And we are back to the neutral position. And underhook here for Schaefer. Rivera keeping head position. And that'll do it for the first. So two to one. Geronimo Rivera with a one point lead over Isaiah Schaefer. Schaefer's going to get set in the top position. And escape for Rivera makes it three to one. Snap down for Rivera. <laughs> oh, he had that. I think he's starting to see some openings as Schaefer, especially righty versus lefty. They're usually going to fire on a single leg, but I'm not saying it's going to be there. One of the things, if you notice, Rivera is pretty light on that lead leg. He's not in a deep, deep stance. Now that's the drop. Well, there's a single leg. And sits through. Catches a second leg. I, mm, it was close. It wasn't two, though. Jafer pulls him back in. And Geronimo Rivera catches a foot of his own. S continues to scramble. Still no score. Rivera finding. Uh, well, he's still scrambling. You know, he didn't stop and, and turn tail and, and run towards the out of bounds. He continued to scramble in there. That's pretty impressive stuff. 20 seconds left. Single leg. I tell you what, though. That's got. Oh, there's a high crotch inside reach to a single leg. And he sits to the corner, does Geronimo. Seven seconds left. If Schaefer can collect the second leg, he can score. But that's a big old if. Geronimo Rivera is tight in that position and rides the clock out to go into the third period. Three to one is the score. Let's see how much work Geronimo does on top. Caution on Rivera. No weight on him though. 
Schaefer, fighting hands, kicks himself, and we got a one-point match. Schaefer starting to get a little bit of confidence in his leg attacks. Let's see if he goes to that inside reach with his right hand or that swing single. Yeah, inside. Well, he's got. He has both legs. Jeron Morveris has a kind of like a an arm wizard, so to speak. You were reaching over the head. He's got a takedown though, and now Shaper has to hold him if he wants to win this thing in regulation. That is a long 110, 115 to hold someone. Reaching back is Jeron Rivera, and Schaefer cuts him, says, let's go on the feet. 4-4, four, 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 50 seconds left. Overhook for Rivera. And nice little snap out of the position for Rivera. Doesn't want to get called for stalling. 15 seconds left. And this one might have to go into OT as well. Oh. Attack here for Schaefer. And that'll do it for regulation. Schaefer goes inside reach. Rivera got popped in the eye. That happens. It's a snap down for Schaefer. 30 seconds left here. Oh, there's an inside reach again. He got the knee behind. Heads to the inside still. If he can collect the second leg. Oh, he does. There's a double leg. Try to chin whip for Rivera, but two right on the edge for Schaefer. He gets the takedown in overtime. Get the job done with 15 seconds left in the first stanza of overtime. 